Should I pull for Child? It's been a year since his last rerun and he's a really old character. I don't know if he's still good. Yes. And if this is you, then you might want to watch this video. There are many reasons to pull for Child, but the main focus of this video is talking about why Riptide is broken. I've been playing Child since he was first released, and I'm very very used to his kit. However, I understand that there are a lot of people who will become new Child mains, and to those people, first of all, welcome, great taste by the way, and second, I want to explain a lot of the basics of this character. Riptide is a core mechanic of Child's kit. Essentially, it is a mark or a debuff that you can apply to enemies in many different ways. Attacking enemies affected by the Riptide status is also his main source of energy generation in his own kit. The Riptide mark can be applied to the following. Hitting an enemy with a charged shot, critting on your melee normal attacks, enemies hit by your ranged elemental burst, and enemies that die with a Riptide status will also apply Riptide to nearby enemies. This doesn't end here, there are also different effects depending on which stance and which skill you use to proc the Riptide mark. Riptide Flash, which is the effect that you get when you use a charge attack in bow stance on a marked target. This does 3 hits of AoE damage. This is also considered normal attack damage. Riptide Slash is the effect that you get after hitting a marked enemy with your normal attacks in melee stance, which deals AoE Hydro damage, considered as elemental skill damage. Riptide Blast, which is what you get if you use your melee elemental burst. This clears the Riptide status, so it removes the mark, but does AoE Hydro damage. This Riptide effect is considered burst damage. And lastly, Riptide Burst, which again is the the effect that occurs when an enemy with Riptide dies, this applies the Riptide mark to nearby enemies. So what did you mean by this? Okay, I know it sounds like a lot, but basically hit enemies equals AoE damage. So why is this important? Well, because Child is one of the few characters in the game that benefit from quadratic scaling. Others being Ganyu in Morgana, Ayato with an Animal Grouper, and Albedo's Burst. Quadratic scaling basically means that the damage you get is increased exponentially if there are more enemies. Not all AoE or area of effect is quadratic scaling. An example of this would be Zhongli's meatball. If I'm using Zhongli on a single target and it deals for example 100 damage, having multiple enemies doesn't increase the damage I deal to one character. It increases my total damage dealt but I'm still only doing 100 damage to every enemy that I hit, whether it be one enemy or seven enemies. Now child because of Riptide on single target, I would hit the enemy once and if they have Riptide, hit them another time for let's say 100 damage as well. This doesn't sound too exciting but for example if I increase the number of enemies to two, then now if I hit both of them with my melee stance, which is pretty common because it's AoE, I will hit them once and if both of them have the Riptide mark applied, proc AoE damage once per enemy hit. So both of them will be hit by the Riptide Slash, taking 200 damage each total. Unlike the Zhongli example, where my total damage is 100 multiplied by E, which is the number of enemies, Child's total damage would be 100 times E squared. So the more enemies I add, my total damage exponentially increases. So three enemies would look like this, and so on. The Abyss, for example, has a lot of enemies on the first halves of floor 12, and you can see why Riptide is so good. There are many reasons that make Riptide broken, it's what made Child stay relevant over the years, it's what makes him the best driver for national team because of his Hydro application, and I don't see him ever being bad in any met. I'll leave you guys with a few clips showcasing Child in the current abyss, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to check me out on Twitch where I stream pretty regularly, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Peace.